it's Thomas Clemens with Diablo Paddle Sports. We're here at the uh, Austin Boat Show 2013. Um, just getting things going on the first day. And I uh, wanted to run through uh, the current setup, the Audios we have up here. Um, this is our new leaning bar. Um, we stability, forward stability. This one's shown with optional. You can put uh, paddle holders, rod holders, accessories. It collapses creepy storage. You can still access the front drive in and it uh, just gives you a little bit more stability. This one's shown with an optional William Joseph uh, stripping basket for the quad fishers, or if you just need an extra place to keep gear. Um, this is also, you see it with uh, the Diablo deck, or what we call the Eddy deck. This gives you a chance to go ahead and make it one flat spot across, tie down your cooler, and then that way you can go ahead and use this as a seated platform, storage, or on the flats you can even stand on here so that you can uh, see across the water and side cast as well. Uh, we've got the Sawyer Versa paddle. This will extend uh, all the way out into a stand-up paddle, or you can put uh, your other end in, turn it into a double-ended kayak paddle for ultimate versatility. Uh, we also are showing off the uh, working pole with, from Yak Attack. It goes into the standard gear track, and it's also shown with the optional rudder. If you don't want to sit up on the Diablo deck or with a cooler seat, you can always go with the traditional setup, which is the Larry chair, and that's shown on the Chupacabra.